Hello everyone, this is Bidasaka Salam from Pest Media and starting from this video, let's uh, do a video series on how to design a WordPress personal website on local WAM server, on local server. In my previous videos, we have designed a website, WordPress website on the lab the hosting account or lab server in this video or in this video series let's do it on local uh, development environment and let's design a personal resume website using free elementor and wordpress using all free tools uh, yeah and if you are interested about elementor pro or any premium plugin you can leave a comment below and i will do a video on yeah using those premium plugins apart from that yeah free or open source plugins and themes are the universal and everyone use it so that's why i I always try to use free tools okay let's start here let's start a warm server okay it is live the local host yes my email username is root password is blank let's create a mysql database let's call it resume you can call it anything credit now it's done and then you have to download WordPress code from wordpress.org get WordPress you can download it and here you can click on download WordPress 5.6.1 and I have already downloaded it's in the download here this is the one and the warm 64 ww here you should you should uh, insert the wordpress core here let's rename this wordpress first rename it i have already yeah you have a wordpress installation here in the local server let's change it to wp and let's you uh, drag and drop the new WordPress Yeah Okay Let's close this one you can rename it this wordpress installation to resume like this okay and here localhost slash resume okay you can choose english or any language you want let's go database name resume the one you we get here this one resume and username for the, the database is root password blank database host local host level prefix then wp ok submit it run installation and site title let's call it resume 
username yeah you can insert a username install wordpress now it's done Log in. Okay. This is the first to install WordPress website on local server on one server. And here, let's delete all those unused items. For example, this default post, delete it and paste the trust delete it comments no plugins delete all okay now and appearance themes Leave the default 2020 and delete everything. Okay, now it's good. And here, settings, permanent links. Before you, yeah, yeah, try to use any, anything. Yeah, yeah you have. Uh, you, before you make any changes like um, installing plugins themes or yeah creating pages and posts try to yeah change the permanent link first save the changes and there is major demerit for building or developing your website in the local server that, uh, yeah trouble something that you have when you design everything in your local server and you migrate that website on the live server in your web hosting account uh, and when you install SSL SSL or plugin like simple SSL or something then there might be yeah um, SSL issues yeah encryption errors and for that that's why I encourage uh, people to de design the WordPress website itself directly on your WordPress hosting account instead of developing on the local server nowadays designing a WordPress website or building a WordPress website is uh, super easy super fast using the this drag and drop professional and premium <laughs> base builders so you can directly develop develop build create design your website on the live hosting account anyway uh, there are also many merits benefits of designing your website in the local server now let's start installing plugins at new we will design wordpress website with elementor install it header footer and blocks install it sticky effects for elementor install it Unlimited elements for Elementor. Install it. Here. And the form. Yep. For that. Yep. Install mat form. It is installing here 
we will need a form widget for this. I call this widget. This is default element of widget. This is for mat form plugin. I call widget where it is element of default widget. For this, there's the monel carousel. We will design it using yeah a limited add-ons for elementor and this yeah portfolio uh, df widget and this uh, yeah yes well, let's install uh, sinai extension for elementor 2 you will try to find a more suitable uh, widget between Elementor add-ons for Elementor or Sinai extensions for Elementor. Where it is Sinai extension? Sinai extensions for Elementor. Yeah, this is the one. Okay. okay. It is installing. You can start. And then this is a timeline widget, progress bar widget, I call this widget, yep that's it. And this is a one page website. Okay, let's see if yeah it is it's still installing. It's taking a little time. I guess in, installing plugins in the lab server is much faster than installing on the local server. Uh, I don't know. It, maybe it is my yeah. Internet is bit. Plugins. For the team, we will use the 2021 team, the default WordPress team. Let's uh, not change it. Keep it okay now plugins yep we still miss the plugins and I extension okay let's activate all this Press an extension for Elementor. Let's activate this too. Okay, widgets. Let's try in the widgets for Sana extensions here. Sana accordion. We do not need Sana content box. Let's give it Sana counter. We do not need Sana dynamic button. We do not need Sana fancy text. We do not need Sana flip box. We do not need Sena Google Mail, we do not need MS Default, we do not need Sena Pysar, we do not need Sena Pricing, we do not need Sena Progress Bar, give it Sena Social Icons, we do not need Sena Table, we do not need Sena Team, we do not need Sena Title, we do not need Sena Transform, we do not need Sena User Counter, we do not need Sena Video, we do not need Sena Visitor Counter, we do not need advanced and a banner slider is there no no banner slider we do not need send a blog post we don't need send a brand carousel we don't need send a contact form 
Yeah, it's not contact form. Yeah, here instead of using the mat form, you can also sign a contact form. The the thing is, uh, design is uh, scope for design is little limited with the sign extension, sign extension form. Let's give it sign a content slider. Yeah, give it an account on. We do not need sign a Facebook feed. We do not need sign a login form. We do not need sign a mail and subscribe. Sign a particular layer. We do not need sign a post tab. We don't need sign a search form, new sticker, sign a post carousel, sign a review carousel. Give it. Sign a model boss, we do not need. Sign a portfolio, keep it. Sign a product jet zoomer, we don't need. Sign up Twitter feed, we don't need. Okay. We have give about one, two, three, four, five, six. About six widgets from sign extension for Elementor. Yeah, that's it. Save changes. And yep. Uh, if you want to reduce the number of plugins, then you can deactivate unlimited elements for Elementor and Metform. Uh, well, almost any extension for Elementor can replace uh, those those widgets, those uh, pieces from Metform and unlimited elements for Elementor. Just deactivate, deactivate them, and if you still need them later then let's activate it and if we still not need them even if after the completion of the web design then let's delete these two plugins okay that's it for, for today we have installed the pl required plugins and uh, we have made preparations uh, for designing this one page resume website on local server and uh, from starting from next video, let's start designing first from the header to the, uh, and footer at the last. Thanks for watching this video series. And if you have any questions, thoughts, video requests, don't hesitate. Let me comment below. Contact me in any way. Contact me through email or feedback, or you can contact me using more my Facebook account. You can also yeah, raise questions about Elementor in Elementor community Facebook group. Um, yeah, active in that group also. Thanks for watching again. And if you have not subscribed my YouTube channel, please subscribe now. Don't uh, forget to click the notification bell icon. Don't miss any uh, new videos about designing WordPress website or Elementor or anything related videos. Thanks for watching again. Have a nice day.